Hi, my name is Jenny. Welcome to my channel, JK Star A Breather. Today, I'm doing a Friday Reads. That's right, it's a Friday Reads from me, and I have a stack of books here to talk about. So let's get going. The first book I have to show you it is Here in Berlin by Christina Garcia. So I started reading this book back in the summertime. It's been a few months since I uh, borrowed it from the library and uh, for a while there I was keen to read it. Uh, while I haven't been making videos over the summer, I've been posting to my blog and I wrote a little bit about this book and so far I read um, maybe oh, uh, to about the 55 page mark and it's uh, proving to be a very emotionally impactful book about uh, a trip that uh, the protagonist goes on to Berlin and she spends her time there uh, going around to the different uh, streets and neighborhoods and uh, taking photographs and uh, seeing uh, Berlin uh, uh, in the modern contemporary uh, time and seeing the uh, the signs of uh, World War II still on the many aspects of the city, and so I the story is told in vignettes, uh, 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 the small chapters, um, snapshots, if you will, of the different impressions that the uh, main. Uh, character has of her trip to Berlin and so I haven't really traveled much so this is a way to go on a trip uh, to see a place I've never been and still have have an interest in going in the future and so yeah here in Berlin by Christina Garcia the next book I have to show you it is Lessons in Chemistry by Bonnie Garmus. So I've been reading this book this past week and I will be focusing my time over the weekend to get this book uh, read. Uh, I am at the, let's see, around uh, 87 pages, almost to the 100 page mark. And there are a little less than uh, 400 pages to this book. And so um, I should be able to get it done and be prepared for the book club meeting happening uh, next week. And so yeah, it's a long weekend here in Canada so I should or I will be spending more time reading than uh, going to places. So yeah, Lessons in Chemistry by Barney Garmus. The next book I have to show you it is Anything Goes by uh, Ethan Morden. So this is a non-fiction book, a history of musical theater in the USA. And so I return this book to this book uh, every year uh, trying to get a sense of the history and society of uh, the musical as it has developed over the years in a hundred, ti hundred year time span of the uh, art form in the states and beyond and so I look forward to diving back into this book. So Anything Goes by Ethan Morden. Next I have a book that I want to start this week and this one is Siren Queen by Nevo. And so it's interesting that I am reading a book about uh, American musical theater as well as one this one is a historical fiction on the life of an early uh, Asian American uh, movie star in, during the silent uh, movie times. And so it's interesting to see the development of the American musical theater along with the film and television over the uh, century of uh, uh, American uh, theater and uh, uh, visual arts. So uh, we'll see uh, how this focus on a uh, pioneer um, Asian American uh, sc uh, screen star, how she uh, broke bears and 
brought more um, Asian Americans into the industry of uh, movie making. So yeah, Siren Queen by Nevo. And um, a book uh, that just fell, I've been meaning to get to this book as well for a long time. This one is The Lottery and uh, Other Stories by Surly Jackson. I have two books by Surly Jackson. Uh, the Haunting of Hill House and this uh, anthology uh, short story collection and so I've been meaning to read them and this is the one I was able to find uh, quickly on my shelves as I had uh, brought it to the front of uh, to where I can see it and so I guess with the spooky season approaching and among a part of us uh, um, it's uh, time to delve into some horror classics uh, and see what the uh, fuss has been about, about about this author and her writing over the years that I, I don't know quite much about but I'm willing to see for myself what um, this author has written over the years. So yeah, The Lottery by Surly Jackson. So thanks for watching this video. This is the end and I hope to see you again next time. Bye!